Howdy y'all, it's your host Rogue, welcome back to Love Games. We're continuing our Saints Row journey today. We're going to see what missions we can get into, so please like, comment, subscribe, share the video. Tell me what you think in the comment section down below. Let's go. Gonna take our helicopter. And go to some of our areas. Let's see. What's the big one? Go to Cat's Radio. So we're going to finish off some of our uh, mission areas so that we can start generating more income. Cats Radio. Hey, Jack. What's up? Just ran the diagnostics. All jammers are present and accounted for. That'll give us a few more seconds on the clock. No, don't tell the FCC. I already did my time. I've been looking for something like this. No, 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 no! I got places to be! The cat's radio is done. Um, what is this? Cutting edge. Yeah, a lot of these we just had to finish talking to the guy to turn them in. Now the more time to interrupt phone calls to the police and correction and reinforcement. Sweet. Ooh, we got a new uh, weapon too. Do you like our Saints Row themed helicopter? Still hoping to be able to get out get one of the Marshall helicopters because those attack helicopters are freaking sweet yeah I know we still have a lot of threat sections to go do so we'll make more money but I'd like to be able to start making some money from some of these businesses This is the Cutting Edge Fashion Foundry. Our collection is complete. The Cutting Edge Fashion Foundry is now fully operational. This has good home energy. It's not a fireworks plant. That a fabulous. Nice. Alright, let's see what we got over here. Planet Saints. We're gonna have to come through here and do all of these uh threat missions. There's a crap ton we have to do. The nice thing is now we got uh, three, uh, yeah, like three more businesses generating us income. Yeah, and the uh, off time over the course of like eight hours, I was able to do the wingsuit things for the Pax Towers. 
They are hard. They're not easy. They're a pain in the ass. It'd have been miserable to watch me keep climbing up there, failing, falling off, in a few cases dying. Now have enough inventory to keep us in business till that boat gets here. Thanks for the save, boss. This is my style. Planet Saints crew outfits. Saints Arizona, Saints Oppressor, Saints Estrada, Saints Granddad, Saints Pedestal. What is this? We still gotta do that. One up here, we gotta do that one too. Alright. So for where we are, let's uh do a few threats. Yeah, when you ride on the rooftop, your ground vehicles rise itself for GPS, off-road vehicles. Okay. Let's see. We need marshal double kills. Get double kills. Don't come any closer! Bye bye, birdie. You are dead, tip chin. All right. That was not bad. Clear martial threat, clear martial threat, clear martial threat. Please surveil. I want the police one last, if possible, because they're gonna end up chasing us. Grinding my gears. There we go. Yeah, it's only the second drone one I've done. Oh. Oh no. It's going again. No. Well. I think almost a fourth of our helicopter health, but official marshal business, back away. Oh, I like that Bye one. Guys. Later, Gator. Another martial threat. Must be hard 
to ensure for Alright, alright, yeah, you did. You did. I'm all taken care of. Thank you, good sirs. Always remember to please like, comment, subscribe, and share that video. Alright. The next one, I think, is a police surveillance. You guys don't see crap. There's side hustles and discovery still. Alright. Well. Go talk with Quinn about ghosts. Better we come down here and do some haunted history. Do some haunted history real quick. Hidden history. Welcome to Go Kart Go. To learn more about the automotive history of Santo Aleso, visit Lake Alacran in the Gehenna Badlands. Listen to every panel on both sites to win a prize. Okay. Already got all the shirts. Why the saints are clearing it up. There's no violence like saint violence. Really? Oh wow, that like totally blends in. Did you know? The race between Winona Goodall and Team Marshall happened on this track. At this turn on the final lap, the Marshall cart spun out of control and good all rode on to a decisive victory. I'll never wear anything that fashionable. This thing better not jam up again. Oh yeah. I hate this. Did you know? To demonstrate the superiority of their kart technology, Team Marshall challenged the top-ranked kart racer in the world, Santo Eleso's very own, Winona Goodall. Okay. We got two more to find. Here's one. Did you know? In 
2007, Marshall Defense Industries launched an ambitious go-kart development project. The company recruited top engineers and drivers to build the most advanced go-kart in the world, the MK979. All right. Why does this go into over here? There's not one in here, is there? Trying to be thorough. Apply to four new jobs myself. Did you know? From 2002 to 2013, Santo Aliso native Winona Goodall dominated the sport of professional kart racing. During her reign, she practiced at this facility to the delight of local fans. Congratulations, you have completed Go Kart Go. This place has seen better days. Like, so much of this city with just a little TLC would so easily go into being a lot better. Alright, so. It's the same thing with like cyberpunk. If people just clean up the trash, fix a lot of stuff, repurposed things, like that whole pool could be operating again. Very low maintenance. Those are my targets. Those are my targets. Oh, that's hard to see though, colorblind. Wow. Oh man, these targets are really hard to see. We've only got eight.
All right, this may help us limit what we're looking at. Hopefully, find some. We're gonna go back just to pistol. Wow, that one was hard to see. Folks, I need your help to help me spot them. What do you guys see? I don't see shit. Wait, open container? Anything in there? Wow. There's one. Here's the other. Talk about fucking hard to see. Here's another haunted history or hidden history. Lisa meeting its obligations to its citizens? No. No, it's not. Like the big snake. Fuck yeah. Did you know? Kids of all ages love Radley the rattlesnake, whose bite can inject enough venom to kill a hundred grown men. Who will die a slow, agonizing death unless they receive immediate medical attention? I want this in the crib. One meaning to fully jump off the side there. Yeah, there is one. Did you know this land was once the ranch of Sheriff Francis McQuarrie, the man who brought Route 66 to Santo Ileso? Each year, thousands enjoy world famous attractions along this stretch of highway thanks to Sheriff Frank. There's one over here by whatever kind of death sculpture this is.
Did you know? Archaeologists believe this roadside attraction was built around 1968, though its original purpose remains a mystery. It might be a calendar or a space for sacred rituals. It looks like somebody just had a bunch of screwed up cars. What's going on here at the Notel, Notel Hotel, Motel? I just feel more raw when I don't shower every day. Ew. I want to leave so bad. Did you know? The Casino Motel celebrates the maritime history of Lake Sebastian with the glitz and glamour of the Vegas Strip. Room 218 still has the bathtub where gangster Billy Romano was gunned down in 1958. That's where you gotta be to be gunned down. The bathtub. This shit is my shit too. Congratulations, you have completed McQuarrie. That's a lot of stuff I didn't know before. Thank you for exploring hidden history with the Cavanaugh County Park Service. Enjoy your prize. Nice. Even Kev would want to wear this shirt. Bizarre. We're almost to the big creepy house in the middle of the desert. Hey, you know Allen Manor, that creepy old house out near Vallejo? I think I've seen it. Well, I know the owner, Quinn. Is that the fraud medium from those infomercials? Yup. They run this whole haunted hotel scam out of the manor, charging gullible ghost hunters for a pricey vacation package. Sounds like good money. It is. And they called me to ask if you could help them out. Asked for you by name? Help? With what? Dude, they that's cool. Say. Well, they'll give us a piece of the business. I'll help with their fake ghost stories. Oh, this is badass looking. At last you have arrived, as we had foreseen. Have you also felt the disturbance? <laughs> Nina's right. This is so convincing. How are you doing that with your voice? We do not understand. This is our voice. Method. Awesome. So, how are we faking the ghosts? The ghosts are real. They are spread across the city, each guarding a demon that escaped the bowels of hell. Okay. I love your commitment to the bit, but... What in the hell did that mean? Your actors vamoose on you because we need them here to scare the guests. Find my ghosts and banish the demons as we foresaw. Oh, I'll find them and tell them to get their asses back to work. Actors. <laughs> nice. This place is cool. I didn't even know this was here. Like, I flew by it once, but I never actually came into it. Like, I love the Giant Saints logo. Can I go through the main gate? I can.
Did that add ghosts to the map? What? I don't get what that actually did. Zoom out. Alright, well, we're gonna go take care of some of these. Because we're over here. I don't see us coming back in here that often. Nothing against it, it's just far as shit out here. You may not be done with me, but I am done with you. Alright, so we've got idle unrest, idle unrest, police surveillance, more idle unrest. Was this police? Yeah, it was. There you go. Luckily, we don't have that many over here to do. I'd like to do the side missions while we're out here, too. But we'll see. I had nothing to do with that. I'm enjoying this. The saints are tools of the oppressed. Shannon time. You won't hit me with that. Doesn't even hurt. Pay no attention to me. Disrespect me like that. Taking cover. Ugh. Join the battle. I'm empty. Flash cracker. Flanking the adversary. <sighs> Dead as a doornail. Yeah.
Definitely got some ammo and stuff from there. Double kills. The safe want power, not change. Didn't even see you. Don't blow up my helicopter now. God, that would hurt. Oh, some of those were specialists. <laughs> we got a history, history, dumpster diving. I won't let that slide. Idle to laugh here. Get gone. Not a good idea. Oh, quit with. Oh, I just punted the thing back. No. Fuck. Fuck. God damn it. Now it's your turn. Join this cause. You won't hit me with that. We've all like hit each other. Gotta reload. You guys are go. killing your own people. I got that guy. You're throwing like the grenades. I'm gonna murder you with a pickaxe. I got one more I gotta do. Oops. I don't know what actually qualifies as a specialist. It's saying kill specialist. Pulled away from there. That's all the threats. So we got two side hustles and ten discoveries. 
I actually don't see any side hut. Well, no, there's one right here. Capture. Sure. Where is this thing? Looks like we're like right on top of it. I am totally just not seeing this board wherever it is. Wow. What is holding us up? And here's one over here. Nice. I like all the LARPing stuff, so this worked out well. Doesn't look like it continues that way. Sorry, this whole thing looks like a uh, tetanus shot waiting to happen. Not that it's not cool looking, but man is it rusty. Oh, too far. I've still have only seen one. And this is what I'm talking about. I need to push more product. Guys gotta push more product. Oh, here's one. Fuck me with that small ass cut. Didst thou know? The last of the Sky Riders set forth from this place 15 years ago. Their kind shall never alight upon this field again. <laughs> Alright, so we found two. I like this. I need to make bigger moves. I better not be late. I think it's going to be one we're going to have to come back to because I legit am not seeing shit. I mean, it's a cool looking area. The Slack Mod Gobbler. Enzo Frazetta of the 53rd Hammerheads perished in the war beyond the sea. May his name long endure. Stop 
blocking the road. I don't want to stop. Here's one. Didst thou know? The Great Council decreed that a stronghold shall stand upon this ground and rule the skies from here to the far horizon. That is pretty badass. This is behind the stage. I don't think there's going to be... They tend to be where people are. Jousting? That would be cool to watch. Vehicle jousting. We do this one. Didst thou know? On this very spot, I, Merrimack the Bitter, vanquished Gongor Tacklebox in single combat. None dare mock my con piece now. Ha ha ha. Dude, I just need one more. Is this it? That's a shot. Right? How Sandy Kraken will always roll. We did this one. I'm gonna click it again. Almost time for my next one. Wait, there is the info board. Welcome to the dust fair upon Frazetta Field. To know the history of this realm, journey thence to Main Street Viejo. If thou heedest these tales, here and there, a treasure thou shalt receive. Thus endeth the lesson. Your training is complete. Huzzah! I'm the master now. The whole time I was looking for the last board, it was the first board. I did enjoy the LARPing we did in this game. That was a lot of fun. What do we find in this wonderful dumpster of fun? Winner, winner. Shoebox full of money. Got one more hidden history over here. Hopefully easier to find. Oh, they have a giant D20. Oh, that's amazing. You can never have too many D20s. Visit Frisetta Field. 
Listen to every panel at both sides to win a prize. There's always something in this town. I really hope the STs don't add a play. Every time I try to talk to you, I hate grappler mains. Glad I came. How about everything around town? Or anything back here? I have a bad habit of going like to the places I'm for sure. There's nothing. It is. Did you know? Viejo is home to the county's tallest electrically powered Mission Bell Tower, as well as the county's best voiceover narrator of Park Service interpretive panels. You tell they ran out of things to say with that one. Why isn't it? It's a cacti. I cannot stand this. You don't want to fall in the cacti. Did you know? The town of Viejo was established in 1881 by a Scottish rancher, Robert Allen. Though tragedy befell the Allen family in decades that followed, this park honors his legacy. Anything over here at the... Famous City Hall. Love it. Yes, it is my name. Oh, there's another one right here. Your weapon stash is most impressive. Did you know? Viejo means Little Valley. The name first appears in 1854 on maps drawn by Lieutenant Jedediah Meeker of the Army's Corps of Topographical Engineers. Move your vehicle! There are so many TV shows. You smell. Well, fuck you too there, lady. Dang. What's this? That's just like a shack. <laughs> I could do this all day. That does it. Their thievery is most House impressive. In the middle of a campaign. Like it looks like there'd be something right here. This is a good way to while away some time. Did you know? Viejo is the birthplace of Hammerheads baseball. The Viejo Desert Owls changed their name in 1949 after the first Scorpion Hammerhead rolled off the line. I'm so close to giving out this. RPG roleplay. Congratulations, you have completed Main Street Viejo. History makes me hungry. Where's Twisty Creamy? Man, I could go for Twisty Creamy right now, too. Enjoy your prize. It's almost Christmas time. Let's go with Twisty no Creamy's roll. Here. Over here. Man, they got a different helicopter. Mohawk Lizard. Shoebox full of money. I mean, it kind of, yeah, it is the same model that I'm driving now. Alright, so all those are done. I'm going to do the CAPTCHA. 
We're still missing two discoveries and one side hustle. Is there anything up here? As I run into a mountain. Don't run into the building. Is this capture? That's cool as shit. Somebody's about to get a horrible review. I don't think I'm following the story in this game. So, this place is full of pricks. Did everything need to despite me? The Opelia exit was lacking. Cactus themed toilets were a dumb decision. Ouch. That's gonna leave a mark. I'm sure you don't get paid enough for this. I didn't realize I was beating cactuses. You won't disrespect me like that. <laughs> Down for the count. Who's shooting me? You're begging for a hurt. Didn't even need pesticide. All right. We did this area. I feel like it's time for a mission. I mean, we've literally cleared out everything over here that's available. There's no discoveries that I'm seeing. So mission wise, what do we got? Going overboard. Energy drink has money for grabs. We'll do this. to return up to the dust lands. Forsooth, our next adventure awaits. Suit on up and meet me out in Vallejo. Verily, as holder of the dust crown, I come. That's cool. Woven into the tapestry of Santo Aliso life are the threads that make up the dust lands. Each year, we test our metal in the dust moot. This year, all soothsayers and readers of entrails, and honestly, everybody else too, foretold that the finalists in the battle for the Dust Crown would be Carlemagne of House Duststorm and Gwendolyn Firebird of House Phoenix. But then onto the scene came a new combatant, Bosonius of House Sandy Kraken. Together with their comrades Elijah the Wise, Ninifer Leadfoot, and DJ Kaviticus. Bosonius didst unleash upon the dust moot a surprise assault that led to the death of both Carlemagne the Dust King and Gwendolyn Firebird. The dust crown now sits upon the noble brow of Bosonius. 
how Sandy Kraken lost many warriors in the fight, and how Phoenix yet more. The bloodshed left both unprepared for the next event on the schedule. The coming great tourney. Twas realized by the leaders of both houses that if either was to have any chance in the tourney, they must unite their houses in the historically problematic but totally genre appropriate bonds of holy LARP matrimony. <laughs> There, Eli. I'm riding out to Vallejo now. Awesome. Our destiny is righteous. Even so, I'm not so keen on getting LARP married to a woman I LARP killed. It hath been noted. Yes, it hath. At least we get to hang out at the dust fair. See you soon. Well met, traveler. Do you seek adventure? Always. Big juicy turkey legs? <laughs> if the yes. Be, I, verily, then join us at the dust fair. Cavanaugh County's premier destination for live action roleplay in a post apocalyptic world of feudal intrigue. Come ride the Slack Mod Golf, back by popular demand, only at the Dust Fair off Route 66 in Viejo. I also seek the historically accurate pizza on a stick and giant corn dogs. Welcome, Borsonius, liege of the Dustlands. Thy wedding awaits. Dude, just get out of the field. Openeth. I hate this. I hate you. Shut up, you're dead. Dustlanders rejoice with the power of the Phoenix Egg. I raise our fallen hero from the ashes. <laughs> Smash the shit out of her face. <gasps> the Firebird doth live again. <laughs> The egg now has one less resurrection remaining for the year. We gather here in the halls of our ancestors to witness the union of two great houses. Do you, Masonius, agree to unite with Gwendolyn Firebird? Yeah, whatever. And do you, Gwendolyn Firebird, agree to unite with Masonius? Not like I got much choice. You want to go it alone? Fine. If I could, I would. Do you still want to? Yes. yes. Then, by the power granted to me by our ancestors, I... Frostlanders! Chill, Queen. Leave none alive! Oh no. For the chill queen. Wow. Game of Thrones much? I love it. What did you do? Me? I don't even know who the fuck they are. Ass. Oh man, does that mean I'm dead? Ow, ow, ow. We gotta go. But my friends. Whatever. Get yourself killed then. I need more ammo. Nineveh, be not a fool.
can't be the only one still sucking air. Can I? We'll tell you to the show. Down for the count. <laughs> now I'm mad. <laughs> That were dicks! Big Make blue dicks! Suck it. Shit! I got mosey. Fast. I have no idea where I'm supposed to go. <laughs> Nowhere to run! You're surrounded, little rabbit! And my wolves are closing in! You're an exit, ain't you? No? I won't let that slide! Bring me the Dustlander's crown! Do as you will with the head. Ow! Actually, yes. Ammunition is needed. If I can't get out, at least I can get the high ground. Dust thou art, but to ice thou shalt return. Still alive, monarch of the dust. We'll see for how long. This here looks sturdy enough. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I shall avenge my fallen friends. There is no escape. I've thought of everything. There they are, on the catwalk. Pow, pow. Find them. I'll not die in these ancient halls. Oh, it drops it when you swap. Don't want to drop Feel that. my wrath, you surfers. Charge the, the enemy. survivors are at gate C. Surround them. Destroy them. Survivors? Where is my spare shot? Oh. Now even aim. Oh, that want a piece of me, ice mongering slush. What? When? You're the survivor? The feeling is mutual. You wanna fucking help me, oh patrol? They deserve oh, that. Take me. Looks like we're stuck together now. <laughs> Ammunition is needed. Away from her, villains! Let the call take me! Remember, Gwen, I'm here saving your ass. Pain before. You should grab well, a shield too. We gotta get out of the building and into the parking lot. Rules designated a no combat zone. We'll be safe there. Ain't no way out the other side. We'll have to find one over here. Better take this. Might save your ass. Or mine. Berserker ability. Gwyneth has given you the Berserker ability. Sweet. There. Bithonius, beware! Beware the... Oh, oh, oh. oh, come on. If you're fixing a fake die, at least say something useful first. You see that? What is it? I don't know. Well, that makes it worse. Thou... Thou art in danger from... <sighs> Oh, that come on. Is some melodramatic bullshit. Ready? Roar! Fuck.
fucking yeti? Die, beast! You clip my fur! <sighs> Oh, Ain't you getting hot in there? You won't disrespect me like that. Surround this You Daddy! Die! Holy shit, y'all. That was a pain in the padded ass. Yeah, it was. But they have a Yeti. Do they have anything else? Because that is actually kind of interesting. The exit. We can get to the parking lot. What the? They chained this with a bike lock. This is a goddamn fire hazard. Fire hazard? That's your concern? Maybe I can pick it. Name your Frostlander weapon. Ooh, who left this line around? Yoink! Frostlander SMG has given you the Death Blossom ability. Sweet. They still think they can escape. Not from my loyal hordes. When pick harder, here they come, begging for hurt. Don't let them flee. Let the hound take me. Let me escape. Who left their paintball gun there? Huh? Death has found me. We're using guns and they're using melee. You kill Yeti, brother. Yeti want revenge. Yeti write full backstory about it. You want to hear? How's that lock? Almost there. Stop bugging me. Just get ready to run. Down for the camp. Creating new characters. Anytime, Gwendolyn. You want out? Move your ass. We're out. Y'all okay? Where are the other survivors? I can't believe he's dead. I put so much work into that character. And for what? They won't get away with this. Elijah the Wise will be avenged. You will all be avenged. More hero bullshit? Good luck with that. You're just gonna let her get away with this? Uh, I don't know if you've noticed, but this chill queen just killed everyone. You want to get killed going after her? Be my guest. I'm going to make a tactical retreat, rebuild, and prepare for next year. House Phoenix will rise from the ashes. It's what we do. How are you going to do that when she stole your Phoenix egg? What? That frosted... Fuck! Art thou in for some hero bullshit? I... <laughs> oh, we are not having a moment. I didn't want a moment with you anyway. Y'all are married. Y'all have to have moments together. That was actually really fun. Frostlander SMG. Frostlander X. Frostnade. Costume Yeti.
Oh, there's a new photo. That legitly was not there before. Really? I hate when I'm like trapped in an area. Come, my subjects, your dust king awaits. Oh, that's so cool. Big mistake. I like the look of that. Panteros certainly met their match. To wear such fashion shows great class. Interesting. What are we doing? Oh, the meat sticks at Fort Thunderpump have given me gastric distress. This is a food joint. It looks oh, like it. Right All right. So now we're still waiting to figure out one more. Seriously, you should go down that the vengeance on the chill queen. Yes. Crosslander costume. All right. You want to LARP team up? Let's team up. I'm waiting for you outside the dust fair. Sweet. So I didn't even get that far away. And they pulled me back in. So, what's your plan to get back at the Chill Queen? Simple. We team up and LARP kill her. What? That's a goal, not a plan. We don't know her strength. We don't know where she is. We don't even know what she fucking wants. No, but the lore master will know. That is true. Play fair games to earn the tickets you need for potions. Come ride the Slack Mod Gobbler and prove thy sage, valor. Parsley Sage, Rosemary in time. Test thy wits and earn thy tickets by solving the murder mystery. Hey, Lore Master. You know everything we need to know about the Chill Queen, right? Uh, the Lore Master did know, but the Lore Master's dead, so. Right, but you can tell us. Wrong. My character is dead. And all of his knowledge went with him. If I tell you what he knew, I'd be breaking the rules. What kind of fucked up bullshit is this? Just go get a speak with Dead Potion, then we'll be golden. We need 250 quest tickets to buy a speak with Dead Potion. And we earn them how? By playing fair games. It'll be faster if we split up. A little competition, eh? May the better LARPer win? Will you grow up and go play carnival games? Sure. Okay. Player looking for game. Stop by the infirmary for all thy duct tape and glue needs. Is anyone kind enough to aid a poor? You there! Stand and hark mine tale of woe, for coyotes did attack mine caravan. I plead with thee, help me in mine quest. Fetcheth me five of their pelts, and I shall reward thee with tickets. Great a fetch quest. I mean, I, I shall complete it, this quest for thee. There they are. Get your fuzzy asses back here. Forthwith! Howl, 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 
Howl. All right, I was gonna be nice. One pelt down. I hast slain thee. Thy pelt is mine. Fake fur is fake murder. That was over here, only one there. Howl, howl, howl. They don't smell like gym socks. They probably were gym socks. Oneth the day. Hark, for I done brought thee the pelts thou didst desire. And I be grateful. But now I needest five hundred more pelts. Thou best be fucking kidding. Well, oh horror! The coyotes cometh for revenge! Not today! <laughs> now I'm mad. Ooh. Later, Gator. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. Oh. oh, that thing said yelp. It'd be so hot to fight in one of these. Like, you would be sweating your ass off. Since you didst save me, I suppose we can forego the other 400 and whatever pelts. I reward thee with tickets. That's more like it. Say, has thy caravan ever come across Frostland? Sort of. They paintballed my car in the parking lot. Fuck wads. Hey, Gwen. I'm kicking ass here. Got 30 tickets already. Oh, that's real good, newbie. I just won 40. Oh. I'm sure you'll do better next time. Damn right I will. A lot of tickets we still need. Bet I can beat Gwen here. Do you dare to ride the slack moored gobbler? Greetings! Art thou brave enough to ride the slack moored gobbler? Ride the gobbler for three laps round the track. Earn time by reaching checkpoints or by feeding the gobbler the unfortunate but well padded peons that stray into its path. Avoid the boxes as they cost ye time. Wilt thou prove thy valor? Most wondrous. Uh, can you. Maybe run that by me again. <sighs> Drive the go-kart, reach the checkpoints. Hitting people adds time, hitting boxes subtracts it. Most wondrous. Let's get to it. Look like it hurt. Ooh, let's take out the box. Yes, 
Behold the fury of my Armor. steed. Ooh, that looked like it hurt. One lap down. <laughs> I'm okay. It's fine. I mean, they're not actually timing me, I just realized. Ye old street pizza. Not the fiercest taste of the desert can stop the gobbler. Four. Now thy final lap. My hand did slip upon the wheel. Sweets. I return victorious. And with proven valor, Gobbler Rider. Unlike those craven Frostlanders, I have heard how they did ambush thee. I pray they'll find revenge. Oh, I'm gonna revenge the shit out of them. Excellent, well. Thy tickets. How's it going, newbie? I just won us another 40 tickets. 40? That's real good, Gwen. I just won 50. Oh, well, we're still short for the potion. I guess one more game each should decide it. I mean, do it. I reckon so. Watch us be a game we play together. But thou love it shall make everything post haste. Complete it. Can any put on their listening ears for long the enough to solve Bosonius, my lead? Have you the skill to question these suspects and find the killer? Ain't usually how I do things. But sure, perhaps a vile Frostlander hath done the deed. Nay, I fear not. Hmm. I heard what they did, though. Technically within the rules, but a dick move. It is now a then, dick move. Valentino the Proud lies dead. All five suspects gathered here had good reason to wish her so, but they all claim alibis. Prithee, can thy wits solve this puzzle? They're at one corner. I am Alice of House Duststorm. I had no love for Valentina, but I would never break the law. Besides, I have an alibi. I was playing chess with Darian at the time of the murder. The Alice was with Darian. I am called Flamewing. If I had wanted to kill Valentina, I would have challenged her to a duel. I was dueling with Eleanor at the time of the murder. You were with Eleanor. Hail, Bosonius. I am Darian. Of House Sandy Kraken, obviously. I had nothing to do with this murder, and I can prove it. I was playing chess with Alice. She hates when I win. So you two verify each other. I am Clarissa of House Tapeworm. I assure you, I am innocent of this crime. When Valentina was killed, I was playing cards with Darian. So you're lying already. My name is Eleanor of East Haven. I have no house to call my own. It was not I who killed Valentina. When the deed was done, Flamewing and I were dueling. That was you, uh, Clarissa. Bosonius, you may ask them to repeat their alibis before you choose the guilty party. 
Now then, great Balsonius, it is time for your judgment. I prithee to choose wisely and be certain of thy choice, as the penalty for murder is death, and I shall slay the one responsible. It's Clarissa. Lux, she's cute. You did it, though. I choose thee! <laughs> Twas my hand that struck down Valentina, and she deserved it. <laughs> I am escaping! Dude. Oh, I have fallen. I do pay for my crime. Gotcha. Noble Bostonius, you have saved us from the murderer. Pray take these tickets in gratitude and kick some Frostlander ass for us, okay? Sure. Oh, it'll be my pleasure, Sheriff. Well, newbie, I just won 50 tickets. Me too. Oh. So we're tied. So we tied. Yeah. Which means no one's better. I hate when that happens. <sighs> Can we just go get the fucking speak with Dead Potion? I'll meet you at the Alchemist tent. Larpe Diem. Come one, come all to the Alchemist Symphorium. Greetings, good gentle folk. What potion do you seek this day? Health? Stealth? A love potion, perhaps. No, absolutely not. One speak with dead, please. At once, the very finest. Brewed from yew berries and the shadows cast by gravestones. That'll be 250 tickets. Right, we got the potion. Let's find out what the fuck is up. Lore Master, by the power of this potion, I command thy spirit to speak with the living. Now tell me what's the deal with this chill queen asshole. In the beginning, there was nothing. Then, the four founders created the Dustlands. Crafting every detail from the stars in the sky to the sands upon the ground. They wrote the rules of blade and gun, of magic and mortality. But disharmony fell upon the founders. One among them cared not for the sanctity of the rules. She sought to sow chaos with her cheesing and munchkinning ways. The other three cast her out, and lo, she did taketh her ball and leaveth to found her own LARP chapter. In the neighboring lands of Meager City. A chapter where cheesing and munchkinning and, seriously, some really OP magic rules reigned supreme. And there she rules to this day as the Chill Queen. To protect themselves from her return, the remaining founders each crafted an item of power suited to their house. House Phoenix crafted the egg, which restores life to the departed. House Tapeworm crafted the bowel rod, whose mighty roar topples all who oppose it. And House Duststorm crafted the Storm Giant's bows, whose protective magic bolstered their great gate. The Founders guarded well these items during their reigns as Dust Monarch. But in time, the Founders left this world. One moved, one had kids, and one hurt her back or something. Their conflict with the Chill Queen was forgotten by all. All it would appear, but the Queen herself. She means to avenge herself against those long gone, to take the items meant to defeat her, claim them for herself, and then reclaim the Dustlands. And she has the first already. Nice. This is like a big story. Oh, this has been just like one mission. That's really neat.
the, the bow run. Howdy, Kev. Eli's calling a board meeting. I'll head back to the barn. So far away. All right. Let's see what we can do. Okay. We got the name, we got the space, we got the logo, we got the employees, and we got the fucking money. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Which means there's one thing left to do. How do we make a statement? Well, uh, we just robbed a money train and killed Sergio in a particularly horrific fashion. Oh, so you ripped out Sergio's heart. I was there for moral support. It doesn't matter, because word on the street is that the Nawali was a one-man wrecking crew. The Saints didn't get any shine from the heist. So, we're gonna need something that establishes us as an institution. All right, so we need to do something that says, we're not going anywhere, come at us. Exactly. We steal the Hummingbird Codex. Marshall wanted to protect it. Panteros and the Idols wanted to steal it. And if it wasn't for that fucking book, we wouldn't have formed the Saints. It should be ours. I like it. How do I we agree. Do it? I mean, I figured we'd just go in with a bunch of guns and kill the shit out of everybody. But if we want to do some heist movie stuff, I can work with that. Yeah, That's cool. guns work. Sounds good. Yeah, we'll blow some shit up. So, the idols hide their stolen stuff in an abandoned boat shop? Under the boat shop. They've got stash houses all over the city. I figure the codex is probably there because it's closest to the museum. And it's practically next door to us? I know. Stealing the codex is going to be the easiest statement we ever made. Hells yeah! Oh, uh, he is guaranteed it's not. Old axe, often the deadliest. All right, kill specialist. Oh, so I still have to do that. That's good. We're going against the idols. Let's use the idol gun. All right, get triple kills, get kill martial gun runners. Destroy hostile vehicles with this weapon. Hostile aerial vehicles. Best of luck to us. The art vehicle should always be parked up here. I really wish we could use some of this money because we have like $12 million to fix the church. The criminal empire should look nice. It shouldn't look like we just bought a foreclosed on church. Good, I surprised myself. Ah. Hey, you neon assholes. We're here to steal back the codex you stole after it was stolen from other people. Ah. I won't let that slide. Ugh. The codex is gonna be off. Open. The collective calls for you. Go! 
Saints are here You're to steal to your shit. Saints came marching in. Oh, it's upstairs. Down for the camp. Uh. Like that one. at the bottom of those stairs. You know what? We should go in and try to get this specialist kill. And it's clear sailing from here to there. Let's go get it! They locked us in. Congratulations on proving your own predictability. Don't predict all the selfish ones. That's not the codex, it's another fake. And a bomb. It's okay, I can disarm this. Probably. Martial training, martial training. Got it. <sighs> Those fuckers almost fucked us up. Then we better fuck them up twice as much to make our statement. You mean find the codex and bust some serious heads? Hell yeah. yeah. I don't think the bomb went off. So we do this the fun way. You gonna die for that. <laughs> My arms have the real power. You won't hit me with that. No, but I will try. They are specialists. Let's think. If the codex in here. Where would they have taken it? They didn't just move the codex. They emptied this whole place. So how do you empty a boathouse? Of course. The collective's yacht. It's like their HQ. I bet they transferred everything there. Then that's where we're going next. There's some jet skis out back. We can grab one of those. The idols won't shoot at their own jet skis. This is going to be an epic statement. That yacht's guarded AF. And every damn one of them is going to learn what happens when you try to blow up a saint. Hells yeah! Let's get in this together! You're controlled by propaganda! They deserve that. Oh, so we got a double kill. Uh, that works. Get skis. Don't jump in the water. Don't jump in the water. Why are you jumping into the water? There we go. We're going to want a different way back. It would suck to get the codex wet. Don't fret. Call home for a ride. Hey, Nina. Can you send a helicopter to pick us up from the collective's yacht? Are you two crazy? Let me see who I can find. What are you gonna do? Swim all the way there? You'll destroy the codex if you get it wet on the way back. Okay. I don't know what that was about. We can use those ramps to get onto the yacht. Totally we're not lined up to use the ramp. Totally still not lined up to use the ramp.
Whoa, whoa, bail, bail, jump! It didn't work at all. I don't see him. Let's go find the codex. We're here to take what we want. Just like you used to. Dragon. Here, people. Protect the collective. Oh, taking them. We're taking you down. I'm sorry, did you oh. think you were safe here? Did people come up behind us? Oh. Where do I go? Oh, now. Nina sent me with the chopper. I'll just hover over till you're ready to go. I think we should take the yacht too. That sounds a bigger message. Y'all tell everybody the Saints took your prize. I eat those for breakfast. I'm so good, I surprised myself. Go for the flight. Let's do. is here yes let's make our stake ah. oh. <laughs> we got the co oh, shit it's booby trapped again I'm getting really tired of diffusing these things oh cut the pink wire got it Where's this fake wire and tiles? They nearly blew us up again. I say we return the fucking favor. Hells yeah! I got the codex. Let's get this bomb to the bridge. I would take the yacht for myself. I think that's a better idea. It's hot! Hoof it! We just went the wrong way. You running, Kev? <laughs> we got the Codex, planted a bomb, and are gonna get away clean on our own helicopter. Now that's a statement. Hey. hey, Kev. Did we just trap ourselves on a boat with a live bomb and a bunch of angry idols? Hell. Yeah. Huh. Like sheep to the slaughter. <laughs> that was nothing. <laughs> this is bad. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I did that. That was me. <laughs> <laughs> a new world. We'll rise from our ashes. We should probably get out of here before our bomb blows up. Reckon so. Ah, oh, shit. I'm the 
gonna take you to Holy shit. Just keep your head down and run. Don't get too close to the flames and you'll be fine. That was nothing. Let's grab that speedboat. Shove the codex in the watertight compartment. I'll drive. Whew. Things got a little cuckoo over there. Seriously. Why does stuff like that keep happening to us? I don't know. Prison riots, derailing trains. It's almost enough to make you question your whole way of... Look out! Idols on jet skis with machine guns! Let's fuck them up! Hells yeah! I'm gonna head for home. You give them a reason not to follow us. Oh, you're just embarrassing yourselves now. Don't bring the party. God. Barely felt that. Oh. Codex is ours, assholes. Oh, man. Dead as a doornail. You can't fight! Pwned AF, losers! You think that hurt? I got this on lock. Give it up! You'll never catch us! Yeah. Whoa! We're about to hit a red. Bye bye, Birdie. Doesn't <laughs> even hurt. I'm going to take a job. <laughs> Still haven't uh, learned not to fuck with the, the saints. They've peeled off. We're good now. So, what were we saying? Huh? When? Just now, before the jet skis and stuff. Um, probably that we were awesome. Stole the codex and fucked up the collective HQ. Yeah, I'm sure that was it. Talk about a goddamn statement. We should have stole it. It should have been our HQ. Our water one. I think it was stupid to blow it up. Who messes with the Saints? No one! I said, who messes with the Saints? No one! You're goddamn right, no one. The Saints aren't a flash in the pan. We're here to stay. The four of us founded the Saints, but it belongs to all of us. It belongs to anyone who dreams of making something of themselves and are fucking tired of the world trying to hold them back. Life is hard enough without having to deal with middle managers with no discernible talent telling you how to do your job. Mm -hmm. Without having to deal with assholes who've had every opportunity handed to them, but never had to fucking work for a single one of them. Without being told that your time will come, you just have to wait. Be patient. Well, let me tell you something. We're fucking done waiting. We all did the work. Now it's time for us to reap the benefits. Kev, I think it's time you throw us a hell of a party. Heck yeah. That was a good one. Idols Barbados? I mean, Bird Codex. Setting up for the party. The word on the street is the idols are in total disarray now that we've blown up their yacht. Them anarchists are in a state of chaos, eh? Who'd have seen that coming? 
We may get a little trouble from some isolated groups, but as a whole, I'd say we've broken the idols. Good. Who said eight shots was too much? This is okay. So specialist with heavy attacks. The enemies from behind have regular attacks. That one's hard. Go ahead, take that one. We're still trying to get the double kills. Triple kills are even harder. Oh wait, now we actually want to do this one. Alright. What do we got going on now? Knock P. Well, I can already tell there's going to be Marshall. Um, let's also look at the map. Let's see what we got going on. We've got a bunch of territory, a bunch of stuff we have not done. Got our first ghost. Cool. Yeah, let's... Let's go do our first ghost. What's up, boss? We own this city. I have no idea what the ghosts actually like do. That's gonna be fun to see. Now there's a haunt or a hidden history over there. Oh, it's an actual ghost. Howdy. Are you one of Quinn's ghosts? Because you better get your ass back to... Wait, your voice... And you're floating. Holy shit! You're not an actor, you're a real ghost! I thought Quinn was messing with me. You are the one Quinn sent to slay the demons? Heck yeah. Holy. Demons are real too? This is awesome! It's like I'm in a horror movie. I fucking love scary stories. Focus, Demon Slayer. You have a task at hand. Right. Okay. Sure. Slay demons first, ghost story second. Cool. I'm guessing like an RPG will do the trick. No mortal weapon will suffice, but I have a gun of the spirit realm for you. That's cool as shit. That's cool as shit. Come this way. I feel like one of the Warrens right now. Do I just point and shoot it? You must charge the gun with souls for maximum effect. That was weird. The demon is this way. So, you work for Quinn. They're real medium? Although they were fake. Why would you want to hire a fake medium? To con people. But with a real medium, we can make so much more money. I do not know if your soul is pure enough to fight a demon. But I guess we'll find out. Can I ask how you died, or is that rude? I don't know ghost etiquette. The town leaders thought I was a witch because I could read and write. 
So, one dreary day, they took me from my home and threw me down the well. They what? I just... fuck people. Do not fear. I got my revenge. Did you haunt the shit out of them? That's what I reckon I do. Better. My rotting body contaminated the drinking water, causing an outbreak of cholera. Half the town died, and the other half learned not to dump bodies in the water supply. Cold-blooded. All right, demon host. The demon must possess a host to survive. Kill the host with the damned rifle to make the demon vulnerable. Pull left to charge the damned rifle. This will release a powerful shot that can damage demons and pass through cover. Disrespect me like that. Get demon. You have it on the run. A new host. Uh, You're begging for hurt. Oh, no, 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 fuck, no. Oh, I don't actually have to charge it. It just does less damage. Yeah, but for the non-demon bodies, it doesn't matter. I can't use any of those. some of the potential hosts. Again, just trying to reduce the potential hosts. Get 
demon. You're gonna die for that. They deserve that. I won't take that line. You're down. going back to hell. Yeah, there's just so many. Dead as a doornail. My shards are shot to jump into another body. Oh, man. Fire. Oh, fuck, fuck. Hot, hot, fuck. Score one for the mortals. The demon is no more. That's cool. It's dangerous. Button up, Kravit vest, trailblazer coat. Protection racket, mayhem. I do some mayhem. Uh, so what was that? Was that We're gonna see how we could see if there's more ghosts? The ghost way the fuck out here. Spooky tree garden. The ghost thing is not bad. One over here. Spooky stone garden. Weird cloud and painting. We're gonna go do what we're next to first. We felt a demon pass from this world. Well done. Quinn. I can't believe it's all real. It's so intense. Just as I said, four demons still remain. Destroy them, and my ghosts can return to haunt our hotel. Good to hear. Hey, how'd them demons get here in the first place? What is that? We, uh, I guess meet us. We must go. What the hell? A car. Just what I needed. Bring reinforcements! Alright. We're gonna go do some mayhem. Or drive straight into a brick wall. Vicario speaking. Hey, Sarge. Ready to make a sale? Sure. I've got some buyers asking about our RPGs. Let's show them what we got. Sweet. Blow stuff up to impress customers and reach your sales goal. Destroy target vehicle quickly to boost the combo multiplier. This increases the value of each target destroyed. That one had to hurt. What you read 
on those buyers. They seem pretty jaded. Better take it up a notch. <sighs> that was enough. Now. Yeah, same with Los Panteros. Show anytime soon. Cool. That was actually fun. I didn't realize what the mayhems were going to be. So, what is this? Protection. Final fist, build a construction, protection racket. All right, we'll go do that next. Oh, man. Really, dude? You oh. think that hurt? Oh. This is my car now. Funny, they stole their vehicle and they're attacking their own vehicle. First strike! I'm at the construction site. What's going on here? The Builder gives no-show jobs to corrupt politicians. Final Fist gains influence and power. Fight them with the Sledgehammer of Humility. Alright, Sledgehammer of Humility. That's fine with me. Heavy Attack, Attack, Flaming Punch. I'm looking for Final Fist. You found nothing but trouble. Oh man, I didn't realize how slow this was. Doesn't even hurt. <laughs> this is not the weapon I would choose. Dude. Sucks. You <laughs> won't disrespect me like that. Come on. First strike. I need to see your employer. You'll have to get through me first. 
And you first strike. Dead as a doornail. <laughs> First strike! I gotta talk to your boss. How about you talk to my fist? You're <laughs> begging for hurt. Ah! How do I do the... Oh. First strike! Here's the deal. Final fist is done in this town. You want protection, you go through first strike. Hey, whatever you say, I don't want any trouble. Cool. Alright. Oh, did that actually... No, it didn't count, because they weren't specialists. Crap. Trying to see, I'm trying to clear one whole area of shit so we can just all in the area good. Honestly, we should clear up down here. So I got to take down five specialists with a heavy attack. I hear that's the same doing all those I, I know what the specialists are with the idols. I don't know what it is with the Pantherans. Well, heck, this is closer. Over here. Find and destroy gang cars. We're still on our way over there. Yeah, I had a washing machine die on me the other day. Really freaking sucked because it was a high end washing machine. Like $1,500. And I got it from a buddy of mine. And I priced the parts. For what went wrong with it, it's gonna cost $190 in parts alone. And that's like, might as well just get a new washing machine. Oh, I wish I had the. I wish I had the thing from uh, Gatling shooter. That was actually really badass. But I went and bought a second hand washer. Now I gotta figure out how to drain my washer because it stopped draining, stopped agitating, stopped running through the cycles. It likes to act like it doesn't have power. So I, I, when stuff failed with it, several things failed with it all at once. So I got to figure out how to drain this washing machine so I could pull it out, put the replacement one in.
Because it is like Shit brim full with water. Sweet. Looky here. I think it's right below us. That it? Jackpot. They say, you know, washing machine is supposed to last 10 to 13 years. I think the longest I've had one without various issues has been three. I'm not rough on them, but man. I mean, we do have some hard water, which I do have treated, but it's still... Panteros were here first. Is that all? I'm at 250 Stay the hell out of Ugh. Are you a specialist? You think that hurt? Ah! None of those are specialists. We will take a Pantaro's bike, though. Oh, and it looks like there's a Mayhem here as well. Van. Dude, where the hell is this van? There you are. Should have stayed home with Mama. This is the big one? Hey, it's me. You're just in time. I've got a buyer in Buenos Aires. She's in the market for a strike fighter with VTOL capability. Do we even have VTOLs? Uh, just some Marshall 921s that fell off a truck. That's a big truck. Oh, hell yeah. So, how'd you get the VTOLs? Just gotta know the right people who can fill out the right paperwork. Looks like Marshall wants their stuff back. Oh, I want one of these. Oh, I desperately want one of these. Oh, it's not what I want. I don't want that.
How are we doing with the buyer? I don't know. She's hard to read. Just keep blowing stuff up. That's pretty much how I solve all my problems. I'm so good, I surprised myself. The buyer's coming around. Think you can keep it in the air a little while longer? I'll do what I can. No promises. And that's how you seal the deal. Oof. That one's actually kind of hard. It runs great, but it wants to go fast. Like, that is meant to be a jet plane. The hole in one spot was kind of hard. So, that RS gas buggy, so that goes to this one. Oh, I am so bad with the wingsuit. Oh, I guess we need to do it because it is a side thing, but this is going to look and be horrible. I apologize for the potential several failures you're about to witness of me crashing straight headfirst into the ground. I am not good with the wingsuit, like, at all. Like, at all. I was not elaborating when I said that it took me, like, eight hours Long to get no see, those done. Ready? Good. I mean, uh, great. I hear you're now gainfully employed. Yeah, but, you know, you could always use a little extra on the side. What are you up to? Consulting. Got a big client in the telecom sector. Telecom, huh? You interested? Uh... Don't really know much about telecom. Oh, I know a shit ton. Me, this work is right up your alley. Still got your wingsuit? Yeah, but I'm a little rusty. Don't worry, we'll go over the basics. You in? I don't even yes. know what we're doing. Come on, let's go for a ride. Do it. Do it, man. Let's do it. <clears throat> the target is a set of receiver dishes on the... Rooftops below. Your wingsuit to each target area and destroy the dishes. We have to do with satchel charges for this purpose. You ready? Ready sure. as I'll ever be. Good. A and D to gently adjust your approach. Control to reduce speed and land. One more thing. You need to finish this job before time runs out. If we miss our window, we gotta scrub the whole operation. Oh. I'm not good with this. The wingsuit target takedown. Aim and throw. All right. Literally, it was just up here. You won't disrespect me like that. 
All right, so we got one more. Don't have enough satchel charges. You reach the next rooftop, launch yourself with the weather moderation. I can use this tower to get a little more height. All right. All right, use wingsuit takedown to damage your target and land to fight. Wingsuit target takedown. Begging for hurting. Oh, come on. And with time to spare, nice work. So this is how they do it now in the telecom business. The market's very competitive. You're a terrible liar. Don't ask too many questions, just enjoy the paycheck. That actually wasn't as bad. The having to hit the little target bouncing off the tower at the wingsuit was a fucking nightmare. That was horrible. Like truly, that was shit. So there's a lot down there to do. Capture over there. There's a ghost over there. Before we go any further over there, anything else? Three side hustles are here to do. Thanks for not shooting. I'm so good, I surprised myself. You're Emilio, right? I heard you need a driver. I need a driver who's not afraid to crash through a police roadblock to get a job done. It's fine. Not like me? What's a cargo? A box. Gonna tell me what's inside? Nope. And no peeking either. Unless you want to die. So long as I get paid, I'm good. Get it. Get her done. Choose your own route to the drop of what the police drag now. These vehicles will appear on your mini map if you get too close, they will spot you. Use nitrous to outrun a pursuer or sideswipe to take them out. Follow the tracks and smash through anything that gets in your way. Be aggressive. Use the nitrous if you have to. Why does this box have air holes? I said no peeking. Oh. Hey. Not expecting that. The cops are all over me. They let them have it. What? The box? No, not the box. You gotta fight the motherfuckers. That's what I'm doing. Give them hell. Show them who's boss. Don't ever let them slow you down. Hey, whatever's in the box, it... It can't get out, can it? Better hope not. The nearest anti venoms at a military hospital. 3,000 miles away. Well, fuck. Dude, just steady out so we can go. There's something you should know. What is it? The city's acting on behalf of a dozen federal and international law enforcement agencies. If you get busted, they'll extradite your ass to Colombia. They'll have to catch me first. Why are we up at our area? That's not where I was trying to go.
We got nitrous. Looks like unlimited nitrous. I'm at the drop. Gotta bust a few heads. Don't let them take you alive. All right. I made the drop. I'm impressed. Come see me if you need more work. Cool. Oh, we could have did a few more of those. Oh, well. Got a gas buggy. Now our Pony Express. All right. There's another wingsuit over here. That's our last side hustle here. The mayhem. Go do the mayhem, then we'll go do the wingsuit we just opened up. Still miss a bunch of discoveries over there. To me, that's just crazy. One of the areas we've been the absolute most of the game. Wow, there's 12 Pony Expresses. A car, just what I needed. Thank you for the uh, car and your life. No witnesses. No, no, get off the top. We're here to cause mayhem. Vicario here. I'm at Vicario. How about we show off some merchandise? Perfect. I got a buyer all lined up. Where are we showing off? Blow stuff up. With what? Oh, RPGs. Should have stayed home with Mama. Looks like the idols have something going on here. Not anymore. Get in on the revolution. I won't let that slide. How are we doing? Looking good. Keep it up. <laughs> you won't survive this flash cracker. I just did. <laughs> Like the voter diving of idols. Almost there. What they did back in the two what twenty twenty? No, twenty sixteen. Cause that may have. What is this? Shady Oaks. Everything here is done. Coming over here. Looks like Wingsuit and Mayhem. The Wingsuit will go right to. And hopefully. We will be able to do without too much issue. You down. Thank you for the vehicle. Don't 
move, asshole. Got your wingsuit? Let's go. Triple kill it. I couldn't read all of it. I think it said triple kill enemies. That was quick. Oh, there's a lot. Distributed across five rooftop areas. Each rooftop is heavily guarded. They're not going to make it easy on you. Don't worry. I got this. You got to move quick. We don't have a lot of time here. You need an altitude adjustment. I mean, that worked. On my way to the next area. How we doing? No time for a nap. Knocking him down. It's not what I was trying to do. Crap. Get triple kills. Where are you? All clear in this area. That puts us almost halfway there. Woohoo! Alright, so we want to do a takedown here. Uh, I completely uh, missed. You won't like what's coming. Oh, you gonna die for that. Three down, two to go. Copy that. What do these dishes actually do anyway? Why? Need a project for the science fair? I mean, it takes a full charge to blow them up. What are they made of? That's a good question. You don't even know, do you? Just focus on the job. Oh. All that did was piss me off. Is that it? Is that it? All right. Down for the camp. I eat those for breakfast. There, dishes are done. Thanks. Now go clean your room. Not until I get my allowance. Kids. Sweet. I got one triple kill enemy. In flap wings. That's gonna be disturbing to look at. Um let's go down. All right, so got mayhem, and then we can come over here for the hidden history. Uh, 
that should complete that one. Or it won't complete it, but it'll everything that we can do. Um what is this? Chop lifting. Yeah, we still have things down there today. One of my guys. Whoa, whoa, same team. No, no. Everyone will join the idols someday. The Saints better not mess with our plan. I just need your car. It's the Santo Aliso Master Thief. Oh, I'm a master thief? That's cool. I didn't realize that. So good, I surprised myself. Thank you, good sir. Welcome to Captain Valera's Rancho Providencia. To learn more about the history of Santo Aleso before 1854, visit nearby Fort Collin. Okay. Here's one. Did you know? In 1821, the government of Mexico gave a parcel of land to Captain Miguel Valera for his military service. Valera built his settlement on the site and called it Rancho Providencia. Okay. This is outside the range. Did you know? These days, Rancho Providencia is a vibrant neighborhood on the Santo Aleso's east side. However, at the time of the original 1821 land grant, Rancho Providencia included all of what is now Cavanaugh County. All right, so doesn't look like anything back here. Can we talk about this tomorrow instead? Someone's getting lit up. Did you know? Under the full moon of July 27th, 1847, Colonel Cullen led his men on a raid to surprise the Mexican army. On this very spot, a pack of werewolves ambushed and devoured the Missouri Volunteers. Damn. Doesn't sound like they were, uh, liking that much. Uh, werewolves liking, you know. All right, so we're looking for one more. Wait, right there. Did you know? In July 1847, Mexican forces under Major Honorato Monteroso placed their guns on this hill to attack El Presidio de Santo Aleso, Occupied by Colonel Joseph Cullen and his 4th Missouri Mounted Volunteers. Congratulations! You have completed Rancho Providencia. A lot of stuff happened around here. If I can't be a werewolf, at least I can look like one. Yeah, I mean, I'm kind of like that myself. Werewolf mask, cool.
The big one, Arms Depot. Hey, I'm at the fairgrounds. Found a good spot for a demo. Then let's sell some rocket launchers. I'm right here. I literally went like five steps away from the thing. Oh. Later, Gator. Jeez, the idols really made a mess of this place. This is one way to clean it up. Two from attack. Go. Barely yeah. felt that. I didn't realize this was their campground. I'm just getting warmed up. You think that hurt? Literally, you just run around and shoot with this thing. They have so much stuff everywhere. Explosions look so pretty at night. Oh yeah, it's the best time to sell rocket launchers. Oh. There we go. We've targeted them so many times. Wish my uh, vehicle was still here, but. Hundred percent, hundred percent, yeah. This is still missing five. I have no idea where they could be. Ooh, the sniper rifle. Yeah, Talk we're gonna put a sniper rifle. We're starting to get Santo Elise Ileso under uh, control. Just barely missed that. Hey, hey, vehicle. I want to be able to customize my vehicles for the Saints. I don't know how to do that. I don't want them just to be just purple. I'd like to put a logo on them, underglow, dark purple, instead of like kind of like how they do pink.
Hey, I need you to ride shotgun again. I have unfinished business with Los Panteros, sabes? You're really doing this, huh? Yup. Panteros need to know who they fuck with. Get them. Kill drivers, shoot out tires. I don't remember what the Dead other one was. Slide. Here they come. Damn. And I have control. And I have control. Ugh. I'm just getting shot. Oh, there we go. So what happened? I taught them a lesson they won't soon forget. Some fools got to learn the hard way. <sighs> that one had to hurt. They really thought they could fuck with me, no? So, you got your revenge. This ain't about revenge. It's about respect. And no matter who you work with in this world, respect holds it all together. So why did you throw me to the curb when I first met you? Respect doesn't mean give you a handout. You have to earn it. And it looks to me like you did all right. You're a good shot. You're making a name for yourself. And you did it all without my help. <laughs> I'm teaching a master class here. Take notes. Those panteros can go straight to hell. <laughs> Better start praying. Ugh. They messed with the wrong guy. This just turned up. They're bringing out the big dogs now. Good. See what their big dogs are. Yo, they really thought they could fuck with me, no? You uh. really grinding my gears. <laughs> Got him. Oh, they should have respected their elders. Alone would scare them shitless. Oh, Let me give you some advice. Never let them forget who you are. Don't think you'll need to worry about that anytime soon. Nope. Not after today. Thanks for riding shotgun. We're not out of it yet. I'm not too old to bust some heads. There was a day when my name alone would scare them shitless. You're gonna die for that. Should have stayed home with Mama. These fuckers need to learn some manners. Reloading! Damn, dude. Not too old to bust some heads. Those panteros can go straight to hell. I am glad my shots hitting the roof do not damage me, because otherwise we'd be screwed. I think they learned their lesson. Cuidado, brace yourself. We're getting the fuck out of here. You're less of an asshole than I thought you were. Don't be so sure. You ever fuck me over? Yeah, Allah, I'm coming for you. Well, the feeling's mutual. Um. Ryan shotgun, my bro. Oh, and we got all of them. Look at that. Yeah, a sniper rifle out of it. There's... I don't know, that's actual image. But like, there's something there. Alright, so we got one more to do. Looks like it's the chopper. So I got five here, which are all gold. Yeah, we got a lot to do elsewhere. 
I'm gonna go do the chopper. Can't take all of us. No, but I can blow off your head. Laura is dead. Did you shit out my tire? Why is it running weird? Running really odd. Not handling right. You up for a casino heist? Oh heck yeah! But the front door is awfully small. Low flying time, hundred and twenty. Smash objects. Stacked in a container. It's a clear grab, but you gotta be quick. Deal me in. And smash a bunch of objects and fly low. Which casino are we hitting? All of them. Four targets. Dealer's choice. Oh, well, don't fly that low. I'm approaching aces high. I've got the cash. Heading back. Where am I headed to? You haven't given me directions. Spend it all in one place. Why are you going so slow? Why are you going so slow? How are we doing on time? We gotta hurry. It won't take them long to figure out something's up. Poseidon is on the hook. Ugh. Alright, I think we got all the smashes we need and the low flying time. Bring it on in. We're ready for you. Oh, come on. That one. Be sure you count it twice. Kind of hit the guy who we're supposed to be getting it for. He just turned red.
So, how'd you pull this off anyhow? I got friends on the inside. Just hit pay dirt. Dude, can you imagine how much cash would actually fill up a 20 by 8 by 8 and a half uh, storage container? Because that's what that is. That would be a lot of money. Like, millions of dollars, probably. Surprise, this is like the first mission with the casinos that I, I can think of. I think there'd be more. I'm making my approach. This one's parked a little close to the building. It's a full house at the Lancelot. We just took four of these. I would, I would say probably ten million each. Would be my guess. Would be what would be inside one of these things. I mean, it could be less, could Wait, be more. We don't want to leave any money on the table now. It's all there, I promise. It, it, there's more than 8,000 there. The freaking containers are worth four. Oh, I didn't, thought it was only... All right. I could have hit more things. I thought it was only 25. So what, this is complete now, right? Yeah. Well. I don't want to go get another ghost, but let's do a mission. Non-complete clause. Yep. Kev just showed up with the party supplies. Want to lend a hand with decorating? Sure. How can I say no to streamers? Oh, I can just warp to the church. I thought it was somewhere else. Oh, I can't because I'm in battle. Luckily, I'm not that far. Why would you have me turn and then turn back onto the same road instead of just driving straight? Sometimes you gotta question your GPS, cause it'll take you round about several times. You guys having a Merry Christmas holiday? To me, it has not really felt like Christmas time. Like, I am wearing my Christmas Zelda t-shirt but it has not felt Christmassy. I think it's the weather going between 50 and 70 every day 
No snow. Like nothing this year has felt Christmassy. Besides watching the Christmas movies we tend to always watch. Just watched uh, Ernest Saves Christmas last night. Do you think we have enough crate paper? Come again? Crate paper. Do we have enough? <laughs> it's crepe paper with a P. Really? Yeah, really. Sorry, folks. Party's over. Who the fuck are you? Chet Drummond, Marshal General Counsel. The Saints are now a wholly owned subsidiary of Marshall Defense Industries. Ha! <laughs> uh, no. The employment agreement you signed when we hired you contained a non-compete clause. I signed a lot of shit. I didn't actually read it. Not our problem. By attacking Marshall interests, to wit, the Frontier Prison, our cargo train, and various other assets, you became a competitor. So, what's your fucking point? Pursuant to Article 9, Section 12, Paragraph 36A, you have surrendered all rights and ownership of the Saints to us. But no. I? Oh my god, he's right. Of course I'm right. I wrote the fine print myself. Kill him. You are aware that didn't solve the issue, right? Yeah, but he was being a dick. That's about to eat well. Atticus thinks we're gonna roll over while he takes what we built? Fuck that. I'm declaring all-out war on that asshole. Hell yeah! It's a revolution! I'll rally the troops. Yeah. Melee, good. Pistol, good. SMG. Idle double kills. Marshall double kills. We want that because we're going against Marshall. Rifle, good. Shotgun. Triple kills. Marshall gunslingers. We're going to want that. That's probably still good. All right. We're going against Marshall. We're going to go against Marshall. We're going to learn the hard way not to fuck with the Saints. Yeah, we want double kills. Come on, Kev. You know Marshall won't fight this kind of war. They'll fight a war of red tape. We need to think this out. I have thought it out. I'm gonna fucking kill Atticus. Saw that coming. But that won't solve our problem. It'll solve my anger. This is a binding legal document. You can't just shoot your way through it. Yeah, you kill everyone in Marshall. Words this time. Fine. I'll call Atticus and tell him why I'm going to fucking kill him. A step in the right direction. You have called Marshall Defense Industries. Please listen to the menu options as they have recently changed. What do I press to speak to a person? For customer service, press 1. For billing, press 2. For the complaints department, press 3. Finally. All of our operators are currently busy. To leave a callback number, press 1. To leave a message, press 2. To leave a death threat, press three. Fuck you. Three. Sorry, that inbox is full. Goodbye. <laughs> oh, that is Those epic. Words, back to murder. Murder can't solve everything. Yes, you it can. I'm just saying we'll need to use our heads to get out of this one. This is more complicated than our usual shit. Look, mm. let's just kill Atticus first so everyone can calm down and then you can think of a real solution. Sounds like a win-win. You know, except for Atticus. But fuck him. Am I right? Wow, exactly, you know fuck him. We're being enablers right now. They're not saying anything that's not true. If you dismantle Marshall to where there's not a single person within Marshall alive, there's no one to try to claim control of the Saints. But even though we are the said president of the Saints, we are not the owner of the Saints. It is a collective membership of four people. Best Marshall could do would be claim 25%. We're here. Let's bust in.
Oh shit. Didn't realize they were down. Dude, who's down now? I can't. How they all get down the gang's all immediately? Here. I'm so good, I surprised myself. We're here. Let's bust in and make our way to the top floor. That's where Shithead's office is. You give us our criminal empire back! Why isn't it that blown up? There it goes. That's... I was using the wrong weapon. Didn't say my weapon swap. The safe Fuck. can't be owned, assholes! Atticus, you some bitch! Come down here and fight me! Much as I love to see Atticus fight his own battles for once. That is not a stock. Then we take the elevator straight to him. I'll stay here with the crew and hold off any reinforcements. Copy that. Stay safe. It changed all my weapons. That sucks. I have no martial weapons. Anti-martial weapons, that is. I don't know what to do to Atticus first. Punch him in the face or kneecap him. You could just shoot him. No, I want to draw this out. Make him feel it, you know? Curb stomping? Kind of a pain to haul him outside. None of that will help our cause. You know that, right? Then what will? We could tie it up in court. In court? We're criminals. Not in Marshall's books. I'm sure they'll list us as a corporate acquisition. Play it right and we could drag this out for years. We ain't waiting years. Except for in this fucking elevator. Seriously, what the fuck? What happened? Why'd we stop? Security lockdown. We're hoofing it from here. Welcome to Marshall Defense Industries. What may I... Should have stayed home with Mama. Get behind something. You think that hurt? <laughs> See? Ain't taking years to get through this way. We're not actually getting through. <sighs> Welcome to Marshall Legal. Shit, it's a trap. There's snipers on the upper floor. Oh, I should snipe them back. Hey. Doesn't <laughs> even hurt. Take those snipers out. Oh, they deserve that. Oh. Shit, they're all down. Really, really, really. <laughs> Taking years to get through this way. We're not actually getting through. <sighs> All right, so well, it's at least maxed out. Ah. Welcome to Marshall Legal. Shit, it's a trap. There's snipers on the upper floor. You, I should snipe them back. <clears throat> Knocking him down. <laughs> Don't put that dirty without me. <laughs> you have more fight in you. Appreciate the help. Fuck it, snipers. Where is Eli? Where is Eli? You two go on. I'll make sure no one. 
Really? I made it this far, just... You two go on. I'll make sure no one follows you. Hey, if you get any downtime, search the legal files for documents on the acquisition. All right, that's good. Welcome to Marshall Research and Development. Bye bye, Birdie. Looks like this elevator is the only way up. So let's go. Key card required. Damn, it's locked. Check the desk. Someone always leaves their key card at work. Why can't I just shoot it? That's not how it works! I told you, you can't just shoot your way through all your problems! Fine. You say that, but it's been working pretty well so far. Key card here. Son of a But there is something there. The key card. There is an incoming call from Atticus Marshall. So, did you really think you could just waltz into my building? Oh crap. Did a pretty good job waltzing into your building. So, did you really think you could just waltz into my building and take your little saints? <laughs> this assault is nothing more than a temper tantrum. You go in. Shoot whomever you like. I'll rehire. Destroy the whole fucking building. Dude, you're already down again. here either this fella has a key card see i told you so you told me i'd find one in a desk i had to murder this guy to get it i guess we're both right shall we go yeah welcome to the marshall executive floor intruders located putting them down well shit Big mistake. Uh, knocking them down Smells like privilege in here. <laughs> oh. Uh. Oh. Oh. I'm coming for you, you old bastard. Uh. <laughs> Weapon sideways. That pack he's wearing! It's powering the guns! Your ivory tower is gonna fall. Ready for Atticus's last stand? You go on. I'll see if I can find anything useful in here. Suit yourself. I am coming, motherfucker! Yeah, we are. Ass gonna learn today. Atticus, you son of a bitch. Wait, Myra Starr? Didn't take you long to get up here. 
You are a plucky one. Where's Atticus? Oh, he turned tail and flew away the second you entered the lobby. I told him this whole Saints business would bite us in the ass, but he never listens. Then give us back the Saints. As chair of the board, I could. Only problem is Atticus holds that title. That man has been a bee in my bonnet for a long time. How about we help each other out? Fine. Tell me where he is and I'll kill him. Now, not so fast. You kill Atticus and his seat on the board will pass to his next of kin, who won't help you. Then I'll kill them too. And then their kin, and then theirs. The Marshall family is large and ornery. You kill them all. Help you. But you help me vote him off the board, and I'll scratch your back real good. So, how do we do that? If you make Atticus look bad enough, our company's stock price will tank. Shareholders will panic, and the board will have no choice but to change leadership. That's when I'll take over and give the Saints back to you. All right, you got yourself a deal. The focus rifle. Nice. Didn't realize we were gonna get a new gun. Yeah, two million. Uh, since we're over here, we do mayhem. Sure. It costs some mayhem. I mean, we came in hard, but we came in. The big one? Vicario speaking. I'm in uh, Lakeshore. Got any leads? Just heard from a dealer in Thailand. Her client needs a fleet of gunships. Then let's show her the floor model. Heck yeah. Why can't I fire any more? Really need to impress this lady. Don't worry, she ain't seen nothing yet. So good, I surprised myself. Dude, there's like no cars on the road right now. attention now and let's put on a show later gator
now for the big finale. <sighs> Only if I can keep this bird in the air. That one had to hurt. Bravo! I'm loving those numbers. There we go. It's a big finale. What else do we got going? Got stuff over there. This is the protection racket. Now we're gonna do that. What you doing that for? I don't want your vehicle. Hey, I let you live. I just needed a vehicle. Keep your distance. This is martial business. Why? I got places to be. Then be there. You have to talk back. You know, okay. Well, there's two threats here. I'm gonna just take them both out because it's like back to back. It's just easier when they're both right here. They deserve that. What happened to you? There we go. Plus, we got a lovely little swap vehicle. Ah, wow, like, I keep just finding all these just trying to go to my point. Anyone back in the day watch that show SWAT Cats? I used to really like that show when I was a kid. That is late 80s, early 90s. It's a great show. Oh, there's the Mr. Beast. How you leave the police vehicle when you're done. First strike. Hey, I'm at the cargo depot. That company runs a smuggling operation. Final Fist covers up their lies. Fight them with the baton of truth. Baton of truth? Sounds fun. Should have stayed home with mama. Oh. I won't let that slide. First strike. I have business with your employer. Your business is to die. Oh. First strike. First strike. 
Now we gotta take that baton. Dick. First strike. First strike runs the protection around here. But what do I do about Final Fist? They're not your problem anymore. First strike. All right, so where we are. Planet Saints. Given an any of the side hustles. Another mayhem over here. Yeah, we'll go do the mayhem and We'll do the uh, first strike over there as well. Purple, pink, orange, blue. It's hard to keep them straight. Their colors. Are you colorblind too? Because I am. Uh. Really grinding my gears. It is here like before I even had a chance to select it. Oh. Well, there is a gun store. We could change up what we actually have on us. Would be nice. They're right next door. Guns, guns, guns. Alright, so melee. Still working on that one. Pistol, doesn't matter. SMG. I want to go with martial double kill because we're martial territory. Rifle, shotgun, martial gunslingers. Still working on that. This is Kill Marshall Specialist. Oh, I'm real mad now. Leave me alone! I eat those for breakfast. Bye-bye, oh. birdie. Oh. I hope one of you guys are a specialist. One of you were. I like when the ventures we have to go like they're out are literally in the path of the, the direction we are going. You aren't a kid anymore. Always a kid. Home with Mama. Got a few more double kills.
The big one? Hey, I'm over at the Aztec. What's our pitch? We've got a four-star buyer who needs more armor. You've driven a tank before, right? Sure. Oh, yeah. My first car was a tank. Sweet. Let's go blow some shit up. Boom, boom. Uh, why am I on top of the pyramid? That's right, make it big, make it loud. I don't know how to do it any other way. Him down. Six million. Marshall's out in force. Good. Hold your own against Marshall. We'll sell a lot more tanks. Really? I don't know what made you think literally driving into a tank would be a good idea. Not. Sees busted. Let's just keep that between you and me. I want to know where you're getting all the Marshall vehicles. surprise myself thanks to you we're putting up some big numbers stop by the depot when you get a chance sweet sweet all right so from where we are not there not there. That's first fist. There's a gust over there. Aperture. Action racket up there. That's radio. A lot of shit up there to take out. Was repo. 
first fifth. I am not actively seeing where this was at. Oh, there it is, gut running. That way we can go get it, start collecting us money. We've actually got quite a bit of money now. Let's go vehicle delivery. Oh. That hurt? oh, I love the purple on this. Oh, this one doesn't have nitrous. As we're going over there to start the business, we're going to... Uh, Piss off some people. Saints are just common crooks. Down for the count. I can't believe this. This don't concern you. Oh, it's empty. I don't have any weapon for marshals. This is getting out of hand. Another time, asshole. Honestly, this this would probably be better to get me from point A to point B. For right now. Enough idols. Have any idols? Blow up your headquarters. Find and defend the stash. Check it out. Come and fight with me. Encircle and attack. That one had to hurt. You really grinding my gears. Oh, I got. Don't get too far away. Calling all allies. Another time, asshole. Heavy attacks. I'm using regular attacks. Crap. That was a mistake for you. Dude, it takes so long to do the heavy attack. Ah! 
So I didn't get any additional ones on that one. That sucks. I was using regular attacks instead of heavy attacks. I didn't realize there was a difference on the the kill thing. Find and destroy a police fan. Knowing the police are going to park it and try to be inconspicuous. And that in itself is conspicuous. Wow, I'm really not seeing this freaking thing. We're about to get our vehicle and drive around. drive around the front again. There you go. Should be good. The word is out. When you need the best high explosive ordnance money can buy, the big one's a one stop shop. Except no substitute. Good. Sweet. We got side hustles and threats still to do. Threat way back over there, one there, three over there. I don't want to go do another big one. <laughs> A nuke mount. That sounds interesting. New weapon, new vehicle. Down. Get 
I won't take that line down. All right. First strike. What's up with the golf course? They sell drugs and false dreams under the eye of Final Fist. Fight them with the Bat of Clear Seeing. The Bat of Clear Seeing. I love that. Bye bye, Birdie. I'm right here. Oh. I'm late for my tea time. Members only, asshole. First strike! Tennis, anyone? I've been waiting for a challenge. Like Mick Foley over here with this freaking First bat, strike. dude. Ah, oh, come on. The heavy attack I like using, but it's so slow. That was but I, like, one hit kills most of the time. You First get something strike. good. Punch out, or I'll punch you out. I'd like to see you try. First strike. First strike will provide security from now on. You don't have to tell me twice. There we go. I'm gonna get the bat. I like to keep the bat. That'd be a fun melee weapon. Find and defend the stash. Saints are agents of corruption. I'm getting mad. Yeah! Woo! Walk away while you can. Looky here. Get lit up! Barely felt that! Uh. Oh. Down for ah. the count. Uh. This fight welcomes all idols. Ah. Uh. 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 Uh, Reloading! Get lit up! <laughs> uh, Join this fight! Flaking it! Uh, won't let that slide! Uh, uh, this is a cannon of truth! Find cover! Ah! I'm going that way. Cannon time! Oh, man. So I got one more specialist. No one else is going to make it up here in time, are they? Threats, district income.
So let's see. Skills. Frostnades new. Perks. The after you kick an enemy, your bullets do more damage. Sweet. All right, we're wanting more notoriety, so hopefully that'll help. We need more specialists. Saints fight for money. We fight for change. Oh, like that one. Down Rocking for the camera. <laughs> go on that vehicle just throws you right back out is that a jet ski it is a jet ski I think I hit. You better walk the other way. Uh. You're gonna die. Oh. Ah. 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 This is a of ah. 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 Oh, man, we did pretty good there. Uh, what we got? Two side hustles do, two more threats to do. Where are the side hustles? Is I don't see any side hustles here. Maybe they'll appear after we do more other side crap. Are you serious? Always. Seriously, never. If you are always serious, you have a hard time finding the humor in life. Jokes just make every day more fun and easy. I'm one of those people who even crack jokes at a funeral. It's sad. It's... I... You deal with stuff, and I find humor is great for everything. Alright. Fuck this shit right in the pee hole! I won't take that line down! <laughs> I'm not suicidal. Ugh. Get in on this fight. Dead as a door. 
Jesus! Come on. You can't fight the collective. I already have been. Running towards cover. Gotta kill more specialty people. Alright, so from here, I think the next one, way the heck over to the left. The police surveillance. Yo, what's up? This is Trippy Red coming at you on Flex 103.5 KGRLF, where the future of rap is right here, right now. Freeze! Build that notoriety. There you don't. Not anymore. done but the side hustles which are not appearing over here it looks like there's one last thread over there the capture Oh, I just shot my own chupacabra people. Oops. All they want to do is sell tacos and drugs. Nothing wrong with tacos. You'd think that they'd think it's the idols because I'm driving an idle vehicle. Oh, it's. Damn, I actually have to walk out there. You better walk the other way. That was nuts. Come on. Fight for the cause with me. That gold will last forever. They still need two more. It's ironic my philosophy degree taught me college. Yeah. Alright. That's radio. We have to be missing some because there's a lot of side missions that are just not appearing.
the vertical slice, see what they got to say. What's your rating? Okay, pizza, ugly idols, couldn't tell the pizza was for cardboard. I saw a chef peeing in the alley. Their anchovies are actually crickets. That one's got a sting. You've got idols headed your way. Barely felt that. You want to come on down? Come on down. I'll break you. Oh, come on. Trying to deuce only kills with a freaking sledgehammer is so slow. You're better off dead than enslaved. Get ready to die. I try. Down for the count. Now that was a tasty slice of action. I got four out of five, so I need one more. Oh well. Oh, really grinds my gears. Not good at this at all. Welcome to the Red Faction Memorial Park. To learn more about the history of beer making in Santo Aleso, visit Frank's 8020 Brewery in Smelterville. Listen to every panel on both sites to win a prize. All right. On May 22, 2001, Red Faction made its final stand here against the Altor Corporation. The striking workers sought an end to inhumane working conditions and unethical human experiments. Yeah. Did you know? In the aftermath of the May 22nd massacre, Altor was forced to sell off many of its subsidiaries, including Frank's 8020 Brewery in Smelterville. That's badass, man, but will too. Did you know? The Altor Corporation hired an elite squad of mercenaries to suppress the Red Faction uprising. On May 22, 2001, they opened fire on a gathering of unarmed workers. Sounds about right. Sounds like the Pinkertons. One of the worst gangs in history. If you haven't, watch the... Uh playthrough of uh, Red Dead Redemption 2. Learn about them. Oh, get it. 
Totally getting it. Did you know this brew pub was founded by the survivors of the 2001 Red Faction Uprising? Previously, the site was the regional headquarters of Altor Corporation. I am out of here! Do barrel roll, do barrel roll. Congratulations, you have completed Red Faction Memorial Park. Must have been quite a ruckus. Enjoy your prize. Perfect for any occasion. And just my Custom size. beer. Sweet. Do the necromancer. I'd like to get all the wanted missions done. My guy, let's take on a oh, we just drove in this mountain. One way to land. I don't want it to be too close. I don't want the helicopter to disappear. Which has happened to me more times than I remember. Hey. I heard you had a LARP hit for me? Great, Bessonius! We beseech you to destroy the necromancer that has taken control of the graveyard. Listen close. The necromancer is a traitorous ass. We once shared a raiding party, but when I was attacked and passed into the great beyond, she did not revive me. We were friends. She had the resources to save me, but she let my favorite character die. I shall see to it that she feels the pain of re-rolling. Oh, it's a LARP hit. That's even better. I want to do this with a shotgun. Higher sword! How dare you disturb the great necromancer! The hour of your demise is at hand, foul fiend! You shall rue the day you backstabbed your friend. Protect me, thralls! We shall send you to your maker. Melee death! Your, your treachery protest. hath not been forgotten. <sighs> Couldn't even hurt. Oh. I call upon my dark arts. Do your worst. I cast the spell of mass resurrect. Arise, my thralls. Are you fucking kidding me? No wonder she put a hit out on you. You're powerful enough to save your whole raiding party, but you chose not to. Hey, I worked hard on this character, and betraying my party is what my character would do. And I can only cast it once per day, so just suck it up. Fine, whatever. All my thralls have fallen to dust. I myself must take arms against the higher sword. Uh. Shall make you pay for that in blood. <laughs> You got a different type of weapon. You can't kill me because I quit. I'm going to join the LARP in Maker City. They actually like narrative twists and betrayal plot lines. Cool. You do you. Your revenge hath been fulfilled. She's off to join another LARP. Good. The door can't hit her where the gods hath split her. That's one more down. Meltervale, he's at loss. El Machino. 
Oh, oh, that is so lucky. Dude, I cannot believe. I, I'm usually getting people way across the freaking map. Actually, get somebody who I'm right next to. You know, I could still be required to drive across the map. Hey, I saw your post on Wanted. You put a hit on one of your own? Hell yeah. That pendejo has cheated me for the last time. Can't do it yourself? He knows I'm looking for him, so he's hiding behind some heavies. All right, so what's the plan? Go get Pepito's car. He's real popular in Los Panteros. No one will be suspicious if they think you're him. Where does he park? At the hot sauce factory. Flaming hot panther juice. Ooh, flaming hot panther juice. Now, I do like some hot sauces. Well, some. I like most hot sauces. Christmas is coming up. Birthday's coming up. Birthday's January 1st. And if anyone felt like it. But, uh... See what we can do here. Oh no, I need to steal the truck, not blow the truck to smithereens. Nice talk. I'm at the spot. Pepito's truck is all tricked out. Drive it over to the hangout. So why put a hit on another Pantero? I thought y'all were all about family. He sold me shitty car parts. Twice. Almost blew a hole in my engine block. So it's a fool me twice, I put a hit on you kind of deal? <laughs> you get it. Man. You understand that. And then in another instance, uh... Did you look over the car part? Because a lot of them... Either work or they don't, and you could visually see it. Depends on what it is. If it looks through it went looks like it went through an ass grinder, then you know that it's fucked. Make it good. Hola Pito, come on in. Wait, you're not Pepito! I surprised myself. Oh. Hey, your boys kicked the bucket. Thanks for that. Enjoy the cash. You hit stand. Oh, I was gonna blow up the vehicle. You just steal? No, it's not the same vehicle. Leave them in pieces. I don't see him. You hit a fucking Panteros? Yes, I did. I don't care that you're a Panteros. Now you've done it. Who are we going after now? They were like family to me. All right. I mean, we're whipping these heads right out. I didn't think they'd be going this fast, but hey, we don't know until you know. Hey, live nude show.
Hey, I saw your post on Wanted. Yes. I will need you to acquire a limousine. Okay. A specific limousine. The two men expecting the limousine to arrive, they will think you are their security. They have hired Marshall to protect themselves. Most inconvenient. Ain't no problem. I know how to handle Marshall. I mean, so these two fellas, they are frequent guests of my casino. At first, I thought they were just lucky. And then you found out they was cheating? Yes. They broke my heart. I have one other request. The deed. It should be done at the train tracks. The three of us, we came into Santo Ileso on that train together. So long ago. You knew. Lee off tonight? Yes. Lee ain't feeling well. Marshall's in charge here. Walk with him. Please not be today. Try not to make him suspicious. Until I get there. I'd say I like the white limos. A little bit better than the black limos. Says one last a month out here. Sir, sir, that's not your driver. Fucking finally. It's not good customer service to keep your client waiting. Bruno, how's business? Couldn't be better. Very lucrative night. A busted flush? Maybe be a little careful. It's one of Dom's. So what if it is? Dom hasn't caught on yet. True enough. Couldn't do much if he did catch on. Toothless old coot. Ah, he's lost his edge. All he wants to do is sit around and smoke cigars and reminisce. So long ago, we came to Santo Ileso. Young men together. <laughs> he never had any edge to lose. He was an idiot back then, too. He still doesn't know it was me who cooked the books back when he ran the first place together. Ah, Dom. You don't cheat your friends, man. That's your fam. Holy Jesus. Shit. Hey, what the fuck? What the hell are we doing in this part of town? Driver, these doors are locked. Driver, what's the kid's name? Not Lee. I can't get the doors open. Help! Help! Somebody help! That's a fucking train! That's how you do it. You broke Dom's heart. It's done. Thank you. And now you must excuse me. This is a sad day for my family. I can understand. You don't fuck over your friends. Fill each other up. Don't tear each other down. Sending coded messages. Alright, you're far as fuck away. We are gonna go get a helicopter. Ugh. Hey, you're on the whole other side of the map. No, I deleted my pimped out copter. Fuck.
Maybe. That sucked if I actually just lost my helicopter. They should have you confirm if you're deleting a vehicle permanently. That sucks. And that's when I learned the importance of reading the directions. I like this. Come, come on, helicopter, still be there. Drive. Did it not start the mission? Yeah, it says before I started it. We gotta do more with the murder island too, because that's on unlock stuff for us as well. You really push through the main story a lot and then have really slacked on a lot of the side stuff. Which actually reminds me. Take an extra 300,000. Swift boot of Marshall. Not that scary of a thing is somebody flying a helicopter. Hello. Yeah, I saw your post. Need a spy taken out? Shh, they could be listening. Okay. So, during my ancient astronaut podcast last week, I picked up a coded message by a Russian or a North Korean or... or a Canadian spy. Right. I know it sounds crazy. It sure does. Our national security is on the line here. I tracked the signal to the spy's hideout. Okay, I'll look into it. Looks good. I thought I had all the pictures. Guess not. I know I don't have all the collectibles. Let's have a look-see. Quiet. Too quiet. Hmm. Locked. Ain't no one home. Are you sure this is the place? Absolutely. Well, I don't see anything out of the ordinary. Any outbuildings? A, a trailer or something? I'll check. A 
it's an RV. That RV looks sketchy as a six dollar bill. Ah, Jesus, just blew up. Booby traps. You see, I was right. Okay, so maybe you're on to something here. Of course I am. Everything I believe is true. Ah. Someone's camped up on that hill. Is it the spy? Seeing as they're shooting at me, yes. Okay, take them out. Oh, we're gonna take them out. We're gonna go out to a nice pizza dinner. Why? Like that one. Later, Gator. It's done. <laughs> All those trolls who made fun of me can eat it. I have no idea where my vehicle went. I thought I was going the right way, but I was not. This pisses me off. <clears throat> Guess we're gonna do a hidden history since uh, we're here. Welcome to Lake Alacran. To learn more about the automotive history of Santo Eliso, visit Go Kart Go in El Dorado. Listen to every panel at both sites to win a prize. I am too drunk to give a fuck. I saw something. Usually they're along things like roads, pathways, not seeing anything here. There's one. Oh, but here's one. Did you know? Abner Pulley Whitaker was a machinist for the Pacific National Railroad. In 1884, he built a kerosene fueled, steam powered, horseless carriage in this very shed. So did anyone hear about the uh, guy who just, uh, he made this multi-million dollar company in like South Africa and he made an engine and a vehicle did you know that, uh, Whitaker tested his horseless carriage on this very site, reaching speeds of nearly 15 miles per hour, the vehicle rocketed across the lake bed to set a new county record. He made a vehicle and an engine, and uh, the engine also can work on your house, what is powered by atmospheric pressure. It doesn't use a combustion style, no, so no fuels needed or anything like that. It uses the atmospheric pressure to run. And supposedly one of these engines, which are very cheaply made, can power up to 300 homes. As soon as he uh, published it in America, he went missing. Alacran has been dry for over 200 years. Boaters, swimmers, and anglers eagerly await the day when its cool, refreshing waters flow once again. The whole thing with it is that his company still has all the patents and how to do it. It's like in South America. They're still wanting to progress with it, and people from his company keep going missing. Did you? Carriage exploded on this very spot, nearly ending his life. 
In 1896, he would establish the Scorpion Automobile Company in Smelterville. But yeah, this dude went missing after he tried to come to America to defend what he wanted to produce here. And the government, American government, has been trying to hide all evidence of it. Pretty crazy. You'll learn something new every day, I guess. This speedster needs a pit stop if you catch my drift. K-979. This machine's a legend. When we're out here, we see some to go to. We're going to just hit it up real quick. Save us a future trip. Where is it? Yeah, but that story is a legit story published by one of my favorite cheese heads, Joe Gillespie. Shabadoo, baby. Shabadoo. Don't crash. Let's get to this drop dead location. Cut. Hey, I saw your post on Wanted. I need you to take out my rival, Nikki the Speed Queen Owens. She's dominating the circuit and I can't take it anymore. You sound like a sore loser. Sore loser? Do you want the money or not? Sure. Where do I find her? They're running an illegal street race in Lakeshore. Look for Nikki at the front of the pack. I stashed a cart for you so you can blend in. On it. Oh, crap. I don't want to have to race in this. I've got the cart. How do you want me to do this? Use the cart to make it look like an accident. Like she lost control and crashed. You got it. Meet me. How am I supposed to take somebody out with a go-kart? Dude, what the hell is with everything There's being busted? The pack, and that looks like the speed queen. Putting you in the back of the pack. <laughs> Get back here. All right, all right. 
Every time I catch up to her, she's hitting somebody. Don't blow up my freaking vehicle. I'm about to take out Marshall. Are you insane? Fuck you up. Damn, she's fast. Come on. You're gonna make me spin out. She's roadkill. Yes! Now I have a chance at the title. I hope it was worth it. Another wanted. I need an executive to execute an executive. How far are you? Nineteen hundred meters. It honestly may be faster to go. Oops. There you go. Let's just. Warp, grab a helicopter, go take a mail. No matter below, we're 300 meters closer than we just were. Then we can get a helicopter. Don't do that same mistake again. This is my pimp and saints copter. I don't understand people getting scared and screaming when you're just flying, landing a helicopter. If you were near them, one, that'd be one thing. Yeah, who's this? I saw your post on Wanted. You want to take out a Marshal executive? There's a helicopter waiting for you in Monte Vista. Get in and I'll tell you more. On my way. I'm already in a helicopter. Uh, I mean, if it is an attack helicopter, I've been trying to get one of those. Does not look like an attack helicopter. I'm in the helicopter. Now, what's the target? Marshal's VP of security, Howard Clark. Clark? 
That guy's paranoid as fuck. How are we gonna find him? Through Gordy Page, his second in command. I put a tracker on Gordy's car. He's in Lakeshore right now. Sounds like you've been planning this for a while. You bet your ass I have. Opportunities like this don't just happen. It takes painstaking surveillance and information gathering. Huh. My part always seems so simple. Well, now that you know how much work I put in, don't fuck it up. Oh, uh, leave it to me to fuck it up. With a magnet, strong enough to pick up Gordy's car. That should get him talking. I'll send you his number for negotiations. He's in a limo. Time to get this asshole on the horn. <phone rings> Mr. Page, how are you enjoying the flight so far? Who is this? Put me down at once! I'm looking for your boss. Where can I find him? I said put me down, or you're fucking dead! Better fasten your seatbelt. Howard Clark. Kiss my ass! I don't know if you want to go down that route, buddy. Won't be the first person I accidentally drop. Shit! Or the last. I can do this all day. I'll lose my job if I tell you. I think you would have just lost your shit right there. Are you crazy? You'll lose more than a job if you don't talk. He's at a meeting. I don't know where. Don't lie to me, Gordy. Where is he? I'll send you the address. <laughs> just let me go. Shit. Clark just got in that helicopter. Can't let him get away. Bet I could use Gordy's car to knock Clark off the roof. <laughs> that should do it. Oh my god! You killed Howard! Oh, this is perfect! Yeah? How so? Once I turn your dumb ass over to the cops, I'll get promoted to VP! VP? Well, why don't we go check out your new office? Shit! I'll just drop you off here. What? What? We're going to drop you off at your new office. Uh huh. It said drop him off. Really? Yeah. Who's this? I saw your post on Wanted. You want to take out a Marshall executive? There's a helicopter waiting for you in Monte Vista. Get in, and I'll tell you more. On my way. I'm in the helicopter now. What's the target? Marshall's VP of security. That sucks. Clark. Clark. That guy's paranoid as fuck. How are we gonna find him? Through Gordy Page, his second in command. I put a tracker on Gordy's car. He's in Lakeshore right now. Sounds like you've been planning this for a while. You bet your ass I have. Opportunities like this don't just happen. It takes painstaking surveillance and information gathering. Huh. My part always seems so simple. Well, now that you know how much work I put in, don't fuck it up. Oh, I'll fuck your it up. Your helicopter is equipped with a magnet. Strong enough to pick up Gordy's car. That should get him talking. I'll send you his number for negotiations. That did not go still up. For a hot minute. Got him. Time to get this asshole on the horn. 
Mr. Page, how are you enjoying the flight so far? Who is this? Put me down at once! I'm looking for your boss. Where can I find him? I said put me down, or you're fucking dead! Better fasten your seatbelt. <laughs> Where is Howard Clark? Kiss my ass! Are you crazy? Yes. I can do this all day. I'll lose my job if I tell you. What are you doing? I'm giving you a tour of the city. You'll lose more than a job if you don't talk. He he's at a meeting. I, I don't know where. Oh, you know where. Don't lie to me, Gordy. Where is he? I'll send you the address. <laughs> Just let me go. Shit. Clark just got in that helicopter. Can't let him get away. Bet I could use Gordy's car to knock Clark off the roof. That should do it. Oh my god! You killed Howard! Oh, this is perfect! Yeah? How so? Once I turn your dumb ass over to the cops, I'll get promoted to VP! VP? Well, why don't we go check out your new office? I'll just drop you off here. What? What? Ah! Took care of Clark and Gordy. Excellent. I'll wire you the money. There we go. Don't put me on the ground. Don't put me on the ground. In a helicopter, all of it put me on. All right. Well, we're gonna go back to our place so we have a helicopter let's check out the next one of that our wrestler there's only two we're gonna go to the desert Surprised the idols don't have a helicopter. Lord Colin. Dude, this guy really is way the hell out of the desert. Or at least the burner phone is. Stuck in the desert with a horse with no name. Dun, dun, dun. Hey, a hole. Secret tunnel. Yeah, I wasn't trying to go all the way down. I don't know what that symbol is. Getaway driver. Hey, saw your wanted post. Whatever you need doing, I'm in. A bunch of those pink-haired idols punks are defacing the desert. Take them out. Defacing the desert? What are you, park ranger? Uh, it doesn't matter who I am. I'm the person telling you to wipe out the idols. That's all you need to know. For littering. You want the fucking job or not? Yes, sir. Sorry. The first group is out at the Overlook. Oh, and make sure you get the ringleader. Big asshole in a helmet. I get to kill the last collective member? Oh, I am so there.
Naval car parts. Quit falling out of the helicopter. That ain't cool. That ain't cool. That ain't cool. My helicopter fall down? I eat those for breakfast. That sucks. That sucks. So many things. Ah, uh, let's see. Can't use contacts. Fucking A, dude. This is my car now. Can't think of a better way to actually, uh, to disrupt some idols as, uh, coming in with a police car. Oh, I have to go up trails. This is where a helicopter would have been useful. Found your idols. They are definitely not keeping the park clean. Then you scrub it down for them. Ugh. Give a shit. Stop the loot. I got other places to be. That one had to hurt. Slide. Gotta kill him with heavy attacks. Oh, there's a helicopter up here. clean now except for all the bodies good but that's just the first group I'll send you the location of the others take the helicopter is it straight down oh kind of lucky that it just blow up on me no don't jump off Ship's helm. We got a runner. Follow them to the idol's camp. They'll lead you to the asshole with the helmet. Go on. My friend, my friend. Where are you going? I got an awesome deal for you. You show me where your collective is and I kill you all. Found the camp. That's where you'll find helmet guy. Cut off the head and the snake will die. Where are they? You 
think that hurt? Should have stayed home with Mama. Ah! Know who I am? Because I sure know who you are. Even, even if you kill me, the Collective will rise like a phoenix from the grave. More glorious and more powerful than... Maybe. But they'll do it without you. It's all... dark. Job's done. Good. Hey, since you're a park ranger and all, does that make this a government-sponsored hit? Because that's kind of on my bucket list. No. <laughs> no. So we have taken out all the members of the collective. What is this new one? It's a major perk. Deal less damage but gain more flow whenever you hit an enemy. Yeah. Wait, no. No, I don't want that. The flow I hardly ever use. All right, well, we're going to warp back. Wherever we were, so is there, coming through here, we saw somewhere over here there was, those lit up finally, so there's three, four. Who am I in combat with? There's no one alive. Oh shit, it's the green sabre. All big smoke. Somebody's coming out for CJ. Look at you with your bad self. Bingo. Does this town have Chinese food? Every town has Chinese food. I need to paint over some graffiti. Sweet. Chinese food is the one thing that never has to advertise. It's almost always amazing. And it leaves you hungry after about 45 minutes so you're going to order it again. Look what I found. That should have, yeah, sweet. So now we have five, six, seven. Need to get these finished up. Nothing to worry about. I could use some ice cream right now. I've been trying to get that done for the longest time now. All right. Not skills. Wanted. Honestly, not that far. 200 meters. I, when it says car wrestler, it makes me think that I'm going to have to race.
Howdy. Saw your post. What do you need? A no-good lowlife's been stealing cars around these parts. I demand vigilante justice. How can I make that happen? I set aside a bait car for you. It is just her type. I'll go get it. Okay, I found the car. What's next? Next, we blow them sky high. I left a bomb for you to attach to the car. Damn. Now this is getting interesting. The bomb is on the car. Now to set the trap for this some bitch. Here's where you can park the car. Heading there now. Shouldn't I have uh, put the car in the location before I then place the bomb? I'm literally driving around with a stack of TNT on my bumper. And Santo Elise, where everybody loves to hit you just because the sky is blue. Trap is set. I'll go wait across the street. She looks suspicious. The target's in the car. Shit, the remote's not working. One day you'll laugh about this. Got her. Hell yeah. No more car rustlers in my neighborhood, no sir. There you go. New weapon patterns. That was all the one it had. And we made another. Almost one million dollars right there. So let's see what we do with these murder circuses. So we can go with Chief Justice, Constance Ruiz. We get a dark shot with him, Moltov with her, Bulldogs with her. Rival suit, frag grenade. I don't like that. What's the boot point? Oreo. Your headshots kill automatic refills your takedown meter. First chance when the caskets get. That's cool. I want to go with her first. First purchase and upgrade in the boot. I can only choose one. Pleasure doing business. The more goodies you buy, the better your chances. Now head back to the contestant select screen and pick a contender to your very first murder circus run. Don't get too attached. I hope you're not squeamish. I'll mount your heads as trophies on my wall. That should bring a spark of joy back into life. Each run of Doc Ketchum's murder circus features four caskets chaos. Follow the clues of the map and the HUD to find each one. 
Activate a Cascade of Chaos to kick off a brutal, bloody, non hulled war battle. The last survivor collects the prize. Finish all four caskets to win. Wait, what do I got? So I got this with like infinite run. These wolves hunt in a pack. I do believe Great Aunt Petronella married a Ketchum. All right. So, what is this fire? I see a fire. Each cast of chaos features a cask and condition, an extra breath to toughen up the enemies. See the conditions on the minimap. They tell you what the chaos condition goes with each casket tab. See glory details. Our competitors have found the Rifle kills. Why am I catching fire? without the skis. <laughs> Don't quite know if I'm going the right way, but we're about to find out. Fresh is that blood. Oh shit, that was crazy. I'm ah. gonna beat your ass. Yeah, this dude is like more agile than my character. There's people back behind us now. 
Oh, not anymore. Oh, now there is again. The Panthers have strayed outside their natural habitat. Dock loot chests. These are pan dock loot chests or dock full of land with weapons price by speech action. Amazon's limited because dock ain't made of money. Where's, like, I don't get what the actual loot chest is. Oh, it's below me. Let's see what the good doctor has for this contestant. I guess we're gonna go do this over here first. The Casket of Chaos. I can see that there's somebody up there. You know, I was Take downs. Ain't got really anything there to kick. Welcome the challenge. Oh, yeah. Another victory for the collective. It's like a biathlon without the skis. Like there's another chest over here. Here. 
is sure to prove useful. Oh, the other chest is right here. Circus finale. This is the very last casket chaos, and each run kicks off the murder circus finale. Choose your which chaos condition to save for the last, and load the dice in your favor. Guess what? Contestant matches your matches max level. They'll get to fight the rival in the next finale. How do I? Long range kills. I'll fight hand to hand if I must. Good show. Now my turn's coming. You deserve it. Ah. Los Panteros. A lack of dignity won't save you now. A hunter must be patient and persistent. That's it. Oh, shot. Gotta get them long range. Nothing like the thrill of the hunt. But I guess that's not long range enough. That wasn't bad. You finished a run of Doc Ketchum's Murder Circus. What you gonna do with those boot coins jingling in your pocket? There's literally only one place to spend them. Mosey on over to the boat. Wait. Boot Coin Emporium. Buy more goodies to help you out. So you're level three. How do I get the rewards though? I do want a Molotov. I've been wanting fire from the beginning. So... 
Looks like you go up to level 8. I don't know. Well, we're, we're going to do another one on the next episode. So please like, comment, subscribe, share the video. Tell me what you think in the comment section below. I'll see you on the next episode. Have a wonderful day. God bless. Merry Christmas.